what the Gobies are saying. They said, yes, let's back up. Let's, let's back it up. Six minutes, 17 seconds to the back and run it again. So the Shastras say you should serve the Paramatma, the Paramatmas and all these representatives. And we should serve those representatives of the Paramatma who are our gurus and teachers and parents and ultimately Krishna. So we serve those representatives until they die. And then we take them to the funeral pyre and burn them and their faces become black and they disappear in smoke. That's Shamshan. That's one of the Antiasti Samskara, the last one. Atiesti, Atiesti, Atiesti? Atiesti. Yeah, thank you. The, the ten sanskaras, the Dasavita sanskaras for the cultured, reformed human being. So that's the, the, send, the final send off. Bye. So there's a certain kind of functions and rituals that are done, which means burning the, the attachment, ultimately. That's what it represents. <clears throat> that's why they crack the head at the last point, because the Atma takes shelter inside the head to avoid the fire of the body. So then they crack the head and out. So Vishnath is very broad and really shows us the power of Bhav and Prima, the great Rasakacharyas, how much they know philosophy and how much they know Leva and how much they can realize and present it all. Because he's because unless you look at it, because I was trying to follow the sequence, the krama of the development of those ideas, I was trying to understand, because this is how you actually can learn when you read, is not only to read some comments, but to think about how, why are they, how do they derive these conclusions, and what is their sequence and line of thinking, that thinking this, and now this represents that, and this comes in sequence. So in a gross reading of commentaries of these vastly learned and great scholarly Vaishnavas who are also on the highest levels of devotional attainment, Bhav and Prem, and also actually personal members of the play of the play or the cast. And not they're commenting, commenting and what they call sharing, sharing with us their realizations and knowledge and experience as sadhakas, but then they're also drifting into their siddha sarup and their sarups as gopis and mandris, which means they're right there 